Keys to the game brought to you by Wentz Orthodontics and Road Trip. It's here. Uh, and Red Raiders uh, off of a thrilling 42, well, hold on, let's see, that would be 52-45 win over Arizona State. Get all my scores mixed up. But this was a big win, but now you go on the road, and now we find out uh, what, it's, what life is like on the road against a team that's won 16 in a row at home, the Houston Cougars. I, I would have not guessed that the Houston Cougars have the longest home field winning streak in college football right now, and you mentioned that at 16. Next on that list is a program called Alabama. So you know they've done some good things at home, and I think that's a big part of the key to this game. The other night against Arizona State, the Red Raiders built up 18-point leads a couple of times, allowed the Sun Devils to battle back in the ball game. I think Houston has the emotion uh, and the excitement of being at home, and, and you can't let that part get big for them. You can't let them get out front, or if they come rallying back to you, you got to be able to keep that kind of momentum in check. So I think for the Red Raiders, a fast start is very big. And for the Red Raider offense, which ranks number one in all of college football, again, to be able to move the ball effectively against uh, the Cougars, whether that's on the ground, which you want to talk about, I know, or what the Red Raiders do well as well, and that's throw the football. But I just think you've got to keep Houston and the emotion on that sideline in check. Yeah, and they'll be geared up for this one. This is a big game. You know, this is a program, too, that's beaten Florida State and Louisville and Oklahoma in recent years. And and it's an 11 a.m. kick. You know, that always that's always an interesting one. Because, you know, I don't know if we have any data that would suggest you play better or worse, but that's always an interesting dynamic whenever it's an 11 a.m. kick, whether it's home or away. Oh, yeah. For us, particularly, you've got to get up early. And that's always one of those things you got to get rolling. But, yeah, it's, it seems like it's early in the day. But I think a lot of coaches on the road appreciate the early start because you don't give a lot of those fans uh, all day long to get worked up for a ball game. You get out there and you, you get things going very quickly. But again, I, I just think it all gets back to really both sides of the football. Can the Red Raider defense, which struggled at times, but for what David Gibbs says, I want this defense to be known for, and that's making a stop and giving the offense a chance to win. That's exactly what they did against Arizona State, and that's exactly what he will try and do again uh, later on Saturday to keep the Cougars in check. You know, and, and to me, I think obviously we know what this offense has been here in, in Lubbock, especially this season, Nick Shimanek and, and, and everything, the different wideouts. But I think the road game, you know, it, it invites the running game. You, you better, that better travel. You must establish the running game on the road. I know that they want to try to get that done. Houston's defense is pretty good now. Ed Oliver, and we're well aware they've got, I think, six or seven seniors that start on defense, have started a lot of football games. And I think they're going to dare you to try to run the football. Now, can you get that done? I'm interested to see what Brandon Jones' offensive line can do. And and does Justin Stockton, does Des, Desmond Nisby, do those guys, can they get anything going? Because last year, that's really what kind of shut you down on the road is that you just couldn't – you were only running the ball simply just to keep the other team honest. There was just nothing to be had there. You have to do a better job of that uh, tomorrow. Well, and I think it helps that Travis Bruffy will get his opportunity to be back on the offensive front uh, in this game and that should help. And I'll go back to the last time the Red Raiders played there and we're talking about defense making a stop when you really need it in that game. Years ago, Red Raiders in front, but you allow a 90-plus yard drive near the end for Houston to win that game. Cannot let that kind of thing happen in this one. you got to, uh, as they would say, rise up on all three sides of the ball and, and find a way to win this game on the road. Big one before you start Big 12 play. Okay, so that has been Keys to the Game brought to you by Wentz, Wentz Orthodontics. Now, whenever you're watching the game, interesting voices you may hear. You may want to turn that sound down and listen to my man Brian Jensen, John Harris, and myself on the sideline. So with that, Keys to the Game brought to you by Wentz Orthodontics.